Monster School, the Spooky Sleepover. Norm was going to a sleepover. He was very nervous. It was his first time sleeping away from home. Norm wanted to bring too much. This sleepover wasn't at a friend's house. It was at Norm's school. All the kids were little monsters, but that's not what worried him. I missed my bed already, said Norm. Norm wasn't like the other kids. He could not turn into a bat. He did not howl at the moon. Norm did not cry out of ten eyeballs. He only had two. Norm was just normal. Class had sold the most at the school bake sale. They had won a sleepover in the library. Why does this prize have to be so scary? Norm asked. Mrs. Grunt was the librarian. She was nice, but she was a zombie. She said, this did not help Norm feel safe. Miss Claps was Norm's teacher. Norm had never seen a teacher in her pajamas. Her eye already looked sleepy. Norm thought she might also have an eye in the back of her head. Oh no! Gil fell asleep already, cried Frankie. Gil snored through his gills. That is just gross, Norm said. Pizza time, Gary shouted. Gary is here, asked Norm. I can't see him. Ghosts are like that, said Hilda. The pizza that Gary was eating fell right to the floor. Splat. Hey, I'm still hungry, said Gary. Harry turned Harry. He ate two whole cheese pizzas. He ate the boxes, too. He will have bad dreams, Norm said. Movie time, Hilda yelled. It is a scary movie. Of course, Norm muttered. Hey, look. That is my uncle. Walt, said Vinny. Vinny was so excited. He turned into a bat. Later, Norm brushed his teeth. Other kids brushed their fangs. One girl brushed her face. Face. A boy clipped his claws. That's a little rude, said Norm. They got their sleeping bags ready. Bianca forgot one of her pillows. Also forgot her bunny slippers. Isaac lost his fuzzy blanket and cried his eyes out. Pop! Mort's sleeping bag had sand in it. How can you sleep with sand? asked Norm. It reminds me of home, said Mort. I couldn't sleep with sand or with a mouse in my head said Norm. Oh, it's the snake in my tummy that keeps me awake, said Mort. Hilda, Bianca, and the other girls played a trick on the boys. Norm jumped up. Nor Mort's mouse ran away. Vinny flew home. But Gil just kept snoring through his gills. Soon everyone settled down, but Norm could not sleep. He began to sniff. Everybody asked him what was wrong. I can't fall asleep. I don't have my nightlight. My cat is not sleeping with me. 
My mother did not hum a sweet tune for me. Oh, don't worry, Norm, said Gary. I can glow for you all night. And I can make a cat, said Hilda. Zap! She turned her salamander into a cat that curled up and went to sleep at Norm's feet. Zap! And I am an expert at humming sweet songs, said Miss Claps. She sat on Gar Gary's glow and hummed sweet songs for Norm. Soon Norm smiled and closed his eyes. Sleepovers can be scary, he thought but it sure helps to be surrounded by some very good friends. The end, like and subscribe.